Hello everyone, my name is Sunspox Logic, and welcome back to Seizing to Be Her Demise. Um, in the last episode I had no idea what to do in this place, but now I know what to do because I sneakily had a little look through a playthrough, not too much, just the next step, so I don't get any spoilers. So basically what we need to do is we need to get this soldier to shoot the bat. Um, and as he shoots the bat, or as he goes to, we need to swipe something off his gun, which is this sharp dagger right here. So we take this. Thank you. I've got the dagger. And we can use the dagger to pierce the giant blood vessel, I think it is. Ugh, disgusting. Blood is pouring from the blood vessel and has formed a small puddle. Gross. I wonder what the soldier has to say about that. He doesn't seem to notice, notice it. He doesn't even seem to notice the blood. Oh, okay, the bat's going to the blood. So maybe now he can shoot the bat. You gonna shoot the bat? Go on. You know you want to. Go on. Do you think you'll be able to get it now? It's circling around in a pool of blood. He says it's too dark there. Okay, so I still have to get the bat to sit somewhere. I don't want to cut this. Okay, so we'll use the hammer and chisel to nail this wall down, which I, I think I did do in the last bit, but I forgot to do in this. Okay, it worked. So I've exposed another blood vessel, so what we do is we use the dagger on these. Maybe not. There we go. And again, the blood vessel is destroyed. The soldier doesn't even notice. Is, is the bat going to fly over? Um, uh, I need to get it to move, but I don't know how to get it to move. The bat is now circling around the pool of blood. Do you think you'll get it now? No, it's too dark. It, it would have to be in the light where he can see it well. Hmm, okay. So, can we use the puddle? F the blood ran into the well and formed a puddle. The bat is circling around it excitedly. It seems to be attracted by all the blood. Aha, yes. Gives me an idea. I'll take the skull. Use the skull on the puddle of blood to scoop it up or pour it. It's going to be a mess, but whatever. There we go. Done. The skull is full, filled with blood. And now it'll move to that one. Oh, it's following me. Um, I still have to get the bat some... Oh, I know. The skull full of blood in the, the cartilage because it's heavy. Right? There we go, yeah. It's worked the standing stably. Aha, and I'm rid of the bat too. So, now it's your chance. Do what you were born to do. It's flitting around right over there. Yes, shoot it. He's aiming at the bat, which is flying around the blood skull. Boom! Gone. The bat is dead, the skull has burst, and the wall has a crack. The soldier is beaming with joy. The sadness from before has vanished. It has been replaced by bloodlust. And he's gone. The soldier has vanished. It seems that he's changed his mind about his eternal stay here. Okay, so fragile wall with the chisel. Another vein, I think. Or a, a blood vessel. That's it. Another blood vessel is exposed. Use the dagger on the giant blood vessel. Slash slash. It worked. Right? Oh. Are we going to see this creepy bitch again? I hope we get to see her. Oh, we're back in our apartment. Did I do it? Did it work? Did I defeat the nightmares? It really looks like I did. It did. Thank God. It's really not going very well since I moved to the city. First, the thing with Professor Seligman, which is the first one, uh, being a frag- uh, a fragment of hair. That, that's the first one, a fragment of hair. And then the nightmares came back, in which is part- the, the, the second part. It looks like a bomb went off in here. It can't go on like this. I have to get my life back on track, and I should start with my apartment. I'm too riled up to sleep anyway. It's time to get rid of the chaos. So can we tidy things up now, dirty shirts? Yep, we're gonna start cleaning. My dirty laundry is just lying around everywhere. Mother would go crazy. Intr into the laundry basket. 
Um, okay, how about books? Because we need to p pack the books up, because they're everywhere. Yep. I don't have time to read right now. I have to put every available minute into the painting. Let's put the books onto the shelf. Okay, now the damaged canvases I guess we have to get rid of. Yep. Most of my old paintings are really lousy. They're barely going... They're barely good enough as firewood. My next paintings are going to eclipse everything. Let's go into the cupboard. With a camera that doesn't belong to me. I've got no idea how it got in there. I'll take care of it tomorrow. Okay, so can we move these boxes now? No. Okay, how about these clothes? Okay then, maybe not then. Um I don't I don't know. How about these moving boxes? Okay, yep. Yeah. It's high time that I unpack them. After all, I've been in the city for a few days now. Into the wardrobe. The wardrobe is big enough for all of my stuff. That's cool. Can I move these boxes now, please? There we go. Hmm, why did the boxes fall over anyway? I hope nothing broke. The clothes are stowed away. Now to put away the rest. Oh, here we go. Done. Uh, how about the clothes? There we go. Clothes as well. They're just ha they are just too many clothes hanging here. The hooks are already starting to give. Into the wardrobe. <coughs> Is that everything? Please tell me that's everything. Oh, we got paint spots. We should clear them up, shouldn't we? Yeah, we should. Everything is full of paint. Everything is dirty. I have to learn to be cleaner. Sigh. Is that everything? How about my easel? Can I paint now? I'm finished with painting for today. How about my lamp? Fam family picture. Oh, the family picture. Mother and father. I won't disappoint you. I just know that I was born to be an artist. Ah, oh, that's nice. Can I sit on the couch? <laughs> I don't want to sleep yet. First I have to get rid of the this chaos in my apartment. It's it's not that bad. Oh, right, I get it. I still have the knife to cut them up. There we go, loosen the cords. That's it. The canvases aren't corded up anymore. The music's so pleasant. It's so nice. I, I, sorry, I skipped that bit. They have to be at hand when I'm kissed by the muse. Oh, how I look forward to painting. How about in the kitchen? Damn it. How did the, the, the damaged canvases get there? Good enough as firewood, at least. Oh, I'm putting them in as the firewood, okay. Uh, wood stove, anything, kitchen cupboard. Empty, yeah, okay. Let's, yep, empty the sink. I think that's everything. Everything is clean as a whistle again. Yay, okay, so do we sleep now then? A peaceful sleep, I hope. Bookshelf, some of my books. Still room for my diary, should I put it there? Life may be easier with a diary, but I like challenges. Let's put the diary on the shelf. I do my diary. What's in the fridge? Nothing. Oh! Oh, I've thrown away all the garbage, the fridge is empty now. I didn't realise it was garbage. If it's in your fridge, it shouldn't be garbage. Uh, if it's garbage, it shouldn't be in your, in your fridge. I, sh I definitely have to go shopping tomorrow. Couch, please. Oh, the reason. Sorry, the department is finally reasonably clean again. I am bone tired, I should go to sleep. Hmm. That reminds me, I still have to get a bed. Tomorrow. The couch has to be enough for today. Straight to the couch. It'll be good enough. Oh, I weren't expecting that. There's someone at the door. At this hour? Who could it be? Oh god, I'm not gonna like this. Oh god. Alright, calm down, I'm on my way. <gasps> I knew it. I knew something was gonna go wrong. Oh, what? <laughs> what? No. I thought I got rid of my bad dreams. It's still not over. Oh dear. The heart that fell down. The giant heart is lying here, totally destroyed. No, it isn't totally destroyed. It's still beating. I have no choice. If I want to end all this, the heart has to stop beating once and for all. Okay. Dagger. Apparently that wasn't enough. 
the heart is still beating. It's gonna take a few, isn't it? It's still alive, yep. Another one. How, though, can this heart be? I think that's meant to say tough. Unless I just misread it. I think that was it. The heart is destroyed. Can I leave now? Is all this finally over? What? No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Um. What the hell was that? Whoa. Okay. There's a hell, hell of a lot more. I thought that was near the ending. Sel Selena, wake up. Oh, it's just like the beginning of the game. Get up. We're in a cave or something, aren't we? Where am I? What happened? Was all of this just a dream? I just don't know anymore what's real and what isn't. Ouch! Damn it, everything hurts. My face burns like hell. And every single bone hurts. What the hell happened to me? That's the bed I was lying on. Where the hell am I? What's that? That feels like a mirror. I recognize anything, it's far too dark. I have to see how bad my face is. This pain is brutal. I'm not in my apartment, am I? Maybe not. Oh god. Oh, what's that? That feels like... Bars. Where the hell am I? Wow, where, where are you, Selena? Hmm. Oh, that seems to be a toilet. Gross. Am I in prison? I'm not- I can't be in prison, can I? Oh, something over here. Hmm, glass. That feels like a window. Oh, but we're just not gonna like this, are we? That feels like a light switch. Oh god, here we go. I'm in prison, aren't I? Why have I got a black eye? It looks like I'm locked up. I can't believe all this. I have to get out of here. Oh my god, my face. Who that's, who did that to me? I can't remember anything. Could, could he have done this to me? Shut up in there. Who's there? Someone, somebody's going to take care of you soon. Please still, please be still until then. Who are you? Hello? No answer. That's so weird. Some rolls of toilet paper. Maybe it will be useful later, but for now I don't know what to do with it. Toilet. A shabby toilet made of massive ceramic. Somehow it doesn't seem to fit this room. Oh? The cover of the toilet tank isn't attached. An old toilet brush. The handle is made of wood and the bristles are incredibly dirty. Gross. But the brush come in handy for my escape attempt. I'll just take it with me. Okay then, um, I don't know what else to use, maybe the sink, wash myself up, no, can I use the toilet brush and, no, that's toilet paper memo, that doesn't fit together. Let's look at the bars, the room is separated into two half by bars, there's a locked door in the middle, maybe I can pry it open somehow, damn it, no dice, the bars are too thin to slide through, and the bar, and the door with width withstand a bombardment. I won't get out of here without a key. If only I could see what's in the right part of the room. But it's pitch black in there. Hmm. Without light I can't even see in front of... Yeah, yeah, whatever. Can I poke the toilet brush through to the... That's a light switch, how do I get that? Maybe I should throw the brush over there. Yeah, yeah. Throw the brush. Throw the brush. Hit the light switch with the brush? Yes. I, what do you mean you don't want to risk it? Anything to do with the toilet paper now? Maybe I can... Ah, there we go, yes. Got that. Oh, I have three chances. Come on, let's see if it's going to work. But you missed, didn't you? Damn it, so close. I have to try it again. Oh, we're going to miss all of them. Bullseye. But the light isn't on. The toilet paper roll is too light to press the switch. Cover of the toilet tank? Hmm. Too heavy to hold around. Let's wet the
the toilet paper? That makes it a bit heavier, doesn't it? There we go, makes sense. It's a pretty desperate idea, but I don't have any other options. Maybe it will work. Okay, so let's try and throw it now and see if it's heavy enough. And you missed. And you don't have anything else to throw. Oh no. What the hell, back here? Where am I now? Is this never going to end? A <laughs> sword in the stone? A sharp sword that looks valuable. It's stuck in a stone. It doesn't move one bit. I can't possibly get it out. Hmm. Somehow that seems familiar. Whoa. My goodness. That almost gave me a heart attack. Um, hello, hooded man. Where am I? Why am I here? And who are you? He's not telling me who he is. Maybe he'll help me get away from here? He's thinking. He says he'd be happy to help me. But to do that he needs more information. What? The door to the castle just opened. What about the castle? He tells me that there's a book in the tower. A very special book. And I have to bring it to him. And what book is that supposed to be? He says that I know, I know it and I'll know where it is. Pardon me? He doesn't say anymore. Sigh. Let's just go into the castle gate then. Well, inside to the castle. Oh wow, everyone's so demonic. The other me is standing in front of a bookshelf over there. Maybe she... Maybe she helped me find the correct book? Hello, Selena? Um, what? The other Selena keeps running away when I approach her. Huh? She's found it? She took a book from the shelf and is reading it. Which one is it? Which, which one is it? That's the book that the other Selena just read. I've got it. Hmm? It doesn't have a title. The pages are empty. Is that really the book that the hooded man wants? I should definitely take it to him. This is going to be like her diary or something, isn't it? That's going to be mental if it is. Alright, I've got your book, hooded man. What do you want? I've got the book. Now get me out of here. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've got the book. Alright, I meant to give it to him. Empty book. There you go, hooded man. I hope it's the correct book. He seems to be able to read, read in it. He's wildly flapping the pages, flipping the pages. Oh, he's found something. He says that the sword is the key to end it all. He who holds the sword in his hands can end all this. So I have to somehow pull the sword from the stone. How can I get the sword out of the stone? What? What the hell's going on? Damn it. My escape attempt went wrong, I'd say. I have to keep trying. I have to get out of here. Okay, oh, we'll check the window. I don't think we we'll checked the window. It's pretty dirty, I can't see anything, and it's tightly locked. I have to get it open somehow or break the window pane. Maybe some out there, someone out there will cry. Will they hear me cry for help? Okay, so. I'm gonna toilet brush the window? Too light to do anything. Aha, too light. So if you use the cover of the toilet tank to get out of here. Yes, have you enough for the window? Let's throw this. It's gonna smash, isn't it? Heave ho! Oh dear. It worked! The glass broke. But the bars are still on. Help! I'm locked up here! No reaction. There doesn't seem to be anyone around. Oh. One of the bars is loose. That could be my chance. Alright, time, time to use the toilet brush of life. I can't work on the foundation of the bar with it. The brush, the brush is too blunt and the bristles are too soft. If only it were a little more pointed. Can we use the toilet brush on the bars now, please? Please. May ah, there we go. Maybe I can break off the brush if I wedge it between these bars and done. The broken handle is sharp and pointed now. Great. Let's use this on the window and let's start chiseling away, shall we? Let's see if I can use the broken handle. To further loosen the foundation of the loose bar. Sounds good. 
Damn it. The handle slipped from my hand and fell out the window. Oh, you stupid bitch. What are you doing that for? Jeez. Oh, hey, weird hooded man again. I still don't know how I'm going to get out of here. That's very true. But the sword seems to be the key. If only... If I could only pull it from the stone. The sword is stuck in the stone. He's not moving one bit. Can we use the hammer and chisel? The stone seems to be too tough for the chisel. That would have been too easy. Can we use the dagger then? I don't want to cut this. Okay, so can we use the hammer and the dagger? No, okay. Hooded man? A any, any, any take on this? You know what your take, you know? Feel free to speak up. So you're saying that I need to get the sword... I need the sword to get away from here. Hmm. He nodded. But the sword is stuck in the stone. It doesn't move one bit. Do you know how I, can, how I can get a ladder there? He says he has a hunch, but he's not sure. He needs more clarity about me and my destiny, and that's why I have to get him two clues. Oh, Jesus. Two portals have appeared. But what does that mean? What clues? Okay, let's try the portal on the left. What the hell is this goat? And what the hell is that? What the... The goat runs away. It seems to be scared. Okay. The goat looks very hungry. Should we go and talk to the knight? Hello, Mr. Knight. A giant guy in impressive knight's armor. He's holding an axe in his hands. Hmm. Um, teddy bear? There's a teddy bear in the tree. How weird's that? There isn't anything to eat for the goat around here. All the green stuff is completely withered. There's a teddy bear in the treetop. It looks familiar. Could it be... Is that my good old Teddy? A warm feeling of safety comes over me when I think about it. Is that the object the hooded man was talking about? It has to be. I have to get my Teddy down from the tree. Oh, we got a branch as well. I can easily reach the branch. I could climb up to the... Oh, okay, maybe not then. The branch broke off, so we're going to need the branch that broke off. Pick it up. I just remember it for now. Okay. Dokey, great. It's the goat, you're really pissing me off. You know, see, it does nothing to do with the goat, so let's go back through the portal. And let's go through the other one, because I'm quite interested. Oh, it's the soldier dude! Hey dude, what's going on? What are you doing here? He's not going to respond, is he? He says he's still hungry and he's looking for prey. The bat was only a quick bite. He wants to kill something bigger, something that will make him really... make him really stead. There seems to be a pretty big forest over there. There should be enough animals to hunt in there. The soldier says he'd rather avoid the forest. It makes him, him uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Hmm. Uh, do I need to go in there and get something for you? I mean, I don't have a weapon, but I have a dagger. I suppose I could slay something. Oh, a hung skeleton. Well, isn't that just great? It's got a note, though, so I'm going to take that. Maybe it's a farewell letter. Give me the letter. Give me the letter. Please, can I pick it up? No, okay. I'm going to read this for you, then. Uh, because because she couldn't sleep, I read her the new story. I read the new story to her at sunset. When the sun rose the, the next day, she hadn't. She again hadn't slept. After sunset, I read to her from the story again. She sat at the window when the sun rose on the third day. She had ripped the book apart and was staring with empty eyes as the, at the sun at the rising sun in the east. Okay, this is a bit weird. Whoa, okay, it's one of these things, is it? I'm in the same place again, yeah. Okay, so, um, I need to go that way. No, same area again. Okay, so how about if I go down? This is the same clearing. How is that possible? There's three, three different... Oh my god, no, what? What even? Damn it. I just can't get ahead. I always get back to the clearing I just left. Huh? 
Did he just sigh or... Okay, let's go to the hand in the pond and let's see what, what we can do with this. There's a hand sticking out of the middle of the pond. It's holding something. That looks like my good old pencil. I drew, I, I drew my first drawings with it back then. It was my first weapon against the nightmares. It made me feel invincible. This has to be one of the two objects the hooded man was talking about, but I can't reach it. The pond is deep and eerie. Never in a million years would I step in there. Okay, um, I don't know exactly what, what I'm supposed to be doing here. An eerie pond. The water seems to be very deep. Right, okay, so can we speak to the soldier a bit more? What are you doing here? Uh, he says he's still looking, yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, whatever. Um, yes, I know there's a forest, alright, goodbye. I surely don't have to go into the fucking forest, do I? I mean, I've tried every path and the all fucking, you know, go to like the same place. I really don't get this. Alright guys, I'm gonna end the video here, because I have completely no idea what to do again, just like how I ended the first video. But, um, I will find out a way how to do this, and I will get back to making a video on it. But, thank you guys for watching this video, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!